The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He needs to see this for himself. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Savos Aran of this discovery? Please, hurry. Uh, couldn't you run back and tell him? I don't know what this is, but I do know it is a great mystery. A mystery that poses, well, a challenging question. And that question is, how the hell do I get this thing out of here? And is Orion going to be able to make a display for it? Because this thing's bloody enormous. I mean, it's a giant floating, glowing ball. I can't exactly, you know, just put it in my pocket and waltz out of here. He'd probably try to stop me even if I could. Yeah. It looks like I may be hanging around the mages a while longer. He wants me to go back and tell the Archmage all about this place, which we should do, because I don't have any better plans. Before we do that, let's just... Did I just run around trying to go invisible and sneak up on someone whilst my light was on? How long has my light been on? Don't answer that. Okay. Oh, did we have... Oh, no, 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 that's... Oh, he fell off. He... Writ of Sealing. Galdur Amulet Fragment. Writ of Sealing? Could that be important? Be bound here, Yirik, murderer, betrayer, condemned by your crimes against realm and lord. May your name and your deeds be forgotten forever, and the charm which you bear be sealed by our ward until some idiot comes along and takes it. Galdur, wait. Uh, see, now that actually kind of looks like the amulet I took that was the Sarthal amulet. That... We read something about the Galder legend or something, didn't we? I think we might have. I really do think we might have. Okay, let's just, just keep... So he was sat here, looking at another Draugr, at a Grand Soul Gem. What? You know, th oh, help. That's, that's a step, there's also a coin. The me 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 Merithic Gold Dragon Mark. Oh, that is so for the museum. Stab of Yirik Golderson. Also, for the museum. But do you ever, do you ever sort of wonder what the hell was going on? There's like a story here. He was sat here staring at a corpse, a staff, a coin, and some poisons. Oh, and a dead, well, another Draugr. It's little mysteries like that that irritate me. I find myself wanting to not get surprised by another Draugr jumping out. Have we tried just wandering over and poking it? 
there is a door on the other side. I mean, you could try poking it. I'm just going to check upstairs. Oh, I'm wondering, is... Is this why the night... No, the night vision was kind of useless anyway, wasn't it? Alright, was there anything... Up here? It does not... Look like it, does it? I wondered if I could harvest anything. Okay. Um... I know I'm supposed to be going back. I, I just... I... Seriously, I mean, have we... Have we thought about... Just, I know, I mean... You know what? He's the mage, he's the expert, he probably... knows best. And if he doesn't want to poke it, I'm guessing... it's a bad idea to poke it. Did I just hear a Draugr growl? I... I'm hearing... Oh, it's one of those bloody... Yeah, it's one of... Oh, it's also a chest. Okay. I'm not seeing... Yes, I scared myself with the sound of my own dagger being put away. And... Vagabond? Do, have we got one of the... Ooh. Okay. You know... This is one of those... Flesh. Ice form. This is one of those mysteries I've almost become used to. It's, it's just like... You know... It's almost become like the mystery of the missing socks, you know? You just... You know there's no really good answer for it, and you just accept it. Socks just go missing now, that's... it's just what happens. And there are giant walls that sing to me and then make me want to shout at people. Now I'm going to be guessing Everybody is in bed. You know what? There was a there was a brief moment where I thought to myself, I wonder if Shadowmere could make it across that bridge. And I actually suspect he might be able to. But I don't think my stomach could take it. No, I don't. I mean, I have a... They really should do something about this. I mean, they're mages! Can't they magic something up? They've got floating lights and and magically opening doors and thank you. Okay. So Yeah. I'm going to guess that uh the head honcho is asleep, and I'm probably not allowed to just wander into his private quarters. Not that I would want to probably where would R concerning the door to the midden okay we'll get a night's sleep although we've only got one bed I could hire a room at the inn for you you could stay in the inn okay notice to all if you want to visit the midden that is your business. If you do, remember to lower the bar once you've returned, or else we'll wind up with ice wraiths in the Arcanium again. And another member of the college, in other words, you, has the opportunity to learn how difficult it is to thaw and dry ancient texts to my satisfaction. Urag Groshub. That is an orc name. The Midden. That does not sound like the sort of place I would find... The, uh, Archmage. 
Oh, good grief it is, in fact. Very, very dark. And let's turn on our magic light. Hello? Erzibert, the librarian's assistant. And what might you need? Uh, hmm? I, I was wondering, had you seen the... Uh, the hmm. Never mind. Okay. Was the... Okay, but... I'm glad you agree. Okay, we'll, 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 we'll think about that later. Um, yeah, okay. Yellow Book of Riddles. Got that one. Um, it's a bit the librarian's assistant. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, you don't want to talk to me. You... Oh, everyone's asleep, aren't they? Wait. Um, do you guys never go to bed? I mean, I, 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 is this, is, are we... Always gonna have people in here. It's it's never. You don't I mean? Don't you need sleep? That's what I'm saying. It's healthy. It's good for you. Should not neglect your sleep. No, you sh should not. Um. Uh, okay. I. This is the Archmage's court. Okay. It's it's probably a little rude and inappropriate calling on him at this time of night. And I know you do need a... But this is... It's important, right? It, it is. It... Okay. I think my magic light is interfering with their magic lights. Uh, hello? Hello? I'm... I'm... I'm looking for... The Archmage, Archmage, I'm not totally sure how... Okay, I'm a little nervous about stealing from Mum. Oh, there you are, I think. Is that... Imperial Report on Sarthal. Um, what you learn here will last you a lifetime. Several, if you're talented. Uh... Oh. Are you... Right, Savas, Aaron? You are relatively new here, are you not? I have noticed you, but we have not spoken. Yeah. Do I have to apologize for something? It is... I just, you know, I'm learning. And no, no, we have... No, sir! Sir, let's be... Sir? <laughs> How quaint. I am Savos Aaron, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. Okay, brilliant. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But any? I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Look. Are we clear? Yes, I'm sorry about that. It was an accident. I'm just learning, okay? Um, I need dangerous research must be a problem. No, no, no. Sarthal, big glowy thing. Ah, please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. I'm, I'm sorry, what? Is, is that something that happens very often? We, uh, no, uh, we found some sort of orb. We found something in South Island. Tolfdir, no, we found an orb. I see. I trust that Tolfdir will provide a more specific explanation. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. I doubt he will. It's, it's a bit... Tolfdir normally looks after your little group, yes? Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Staff of Mage Light. Who oh, is the staff that makes light? That, no, that would be very useful. Yes, it would. Speak with Mirabel Irvine. Probably in the morning. Okay. Um, have you a... <sighs> yeah, I might want to mention that. My... Yeah, I'm going to. I think. I probably should. I mean, it could just... No, yes. Have you ever met with the Sigic Order? Personally? No, not I. 
One of their number used to advise the Archmage when I was but an apprentice here. But that was a great many years ago, before all the members of the Order were called back to the Isle of Arteum, and it disappeared entirely. The entire island just disappeared? Has anybody tried to look for it? I'm, I'm assuming the answer is yes. But I thought I'd ask. Sometimes, well, this is Skyrim, and occasionally people really are complete, well, dingbats about things like this. Um, I'd like to know more about the college's history. Yes, I would. I am very curious, seeing as uh, I will be staying here for rather a long time, apparently. I've seen documents dating back to the late Second Era. Beyond that, it's hard to say. Events in the last several hundred years resulted in a significant loss of our history, I'm afraid. Okay, what happened in the last few hundred years? The Great Collapse, as it has come to be known. An unfortunate natural disaster that ravaged the area. The college fared far better than the city of Winterhold, but it was not left untouched. Yeah, I know it's the bridge. Have you given any thought to, you know, repairing it a little? Oh, yeah, what caused it? No one is sure of the cause. Some believe the eruption of Red Mountain had far-reaching consequences that were only felt years later. I know there are some who have blamed the college, said that we were responsible. I assure you this is not the case. Um, yeah, okay, I, I believe you. What is the purpose of the... No, tell me more about the Great Collapse, then. The Sea of Ghosts practically came alive. No one was expecting it. Monstrous waves battered the shore for weeks on end. Winterhold was ancient and weathered, but it couldn't withstand the sea's fury. Entire districts of the city were lost overnight. The waves receded in time, but the damage was irreversible. Most residents of Winterhold abandoned what was left of the city. The college survived, and so here we remain. Right. What is the purpose of the college? Purpose? I should think it's self-evident. Magic is a true power. I'd like to Not hear something you to be shunned say by it. commoners, or treated as an amusing diversion by politicians. It shapes worlds, creates and destroys life. It deserves proper respect and study. The college is a place where we can focus on that, without the pressures of the world weighing down on us. So you've no real interest in the outside world? You just want to learn magic for magic's sake? That doesn't seem... particularly useful, but... Okay, each to his own, I suppose. Dangerous research must be a problem here! Not often, no. Some risks must be taken, to be sure. I am simply trying to avoid untimely deaths. Like we students getting incinerated. To avoid worsening what Skyrim thinks of us. Mm, yeah, no, I can, I can see that. Reputation is important. Right. All right then. Okay. Thank, thank you very much. Imperial report on. S oh, don't. Can I read that? You don't mind if I read it, do you? As long as I don't take it. The Fall of Sarthal by Hesef Kirirnis, Mages Guild Scholar, assigned to Imperial Archaeologist Sentius Fl Florodius. Let it be known that the esteemed archaeologist has chosen to focus his boundless talents on the cooking and baking habits of early First Era Nords. Okay, I'm not sure this is going to be very helpful. While this work will no doubt bring great glory and benefit to the Empire, it is clear that my limited expertise is of no use to this effort. I have instead been using my considerable free time to investigate a particular avenue of study, namely that of the Fall of Sarthal. Every child of the Empire knows what happened here, that the first city of man on Tamriel was sacked by the elves, jealous and fearful of the threat men posed to the them. Relations have obviously improved considerably since then, but to be able to see the results of the destruction firsthand, it is quite striking to note the degree of effort that went into the venture. The first task before me was differentiating between areas of original architecture and those that were rebuilt after Iskramor retook the city with his 500 companions, initially relying heavily on the expertise of archaeologist Floronius. 
My ability to discern the difference for myself improved over time. Indeed, I was surprised to find that many areas of the city, far more than I would have believed, retained much of the original stonework. Work was clearly done to remedy the effects of the city being burned after the elves' assault, but I suspect they underestimated the durability of Nordic craftsmanship. Or rather, that is what I initially thought. Perhaps it was a mistaken sense of pride in the accomplishments of these early men, or perhaps it was just my inexperience that led me to this conclusion. Something was amiss, though. Repeated attempts to consult the exceedingly perceptive archaeologist were unfruitful often digressing into lectures on the bathing habits of South Isle residents or the average number of potted plants in homes. I was once again forced to rely on my limited powers of observation and deduction, and so I have no conclusive result to report at this time. I can say with certainty that the initial attack on South Isle seems to have been very focused and does not appear to correlate to any locations that have been established as points of defence or importance. While the eminent scholar Sentia... Sentius has yet to examine my findings or indeed show any interest in them, my inclination is to suggest that not only did the elves know the apparent layout of the city, but that their assault was based on specific directive and perhaps a singular goal. My humble investigation shall, con shall continue as time permits. So the elves possibly know what is going on there. That might explain the Thalmor presence here. It also might explain why the college is uh, excavating there. All right, that could be useful information. However, I now have to do some research and speak to Mirabel. But honestly, I think step one, get a night's bloody sleep. There you are. I've been trying to find you. Or... I just wanted to let you know that Ancano's been asking about you. I think he's looking for you. Why would Ancano be looking for me? I'm not sure. Just... Well, mind what you tell him, all right? Does... What does it matter? Is there a problem? No, no. Well, I don't think so. Between the two of us, there are rumors about him. That this advisor position he has is a sham. An excuse. That what he's really doing is spying for the Thalmor, trying to feed them information. Whether it's true, I can't say. But it never hurts to be a little suspicious, does it? I like you. Thank you for the warning. You're welcome. Ah, uh, is there any advice you can give me about destruction spells? Don't bloody use them. I, I'll, um, I'll... Mm-hmm. Be sure to come and talk to you. Ooh. Missing apprentices. Missing a... Ask Finnish Jestor about the missing apprentices. The college asks that everyone keep an eye out for the previous group of apprentices has, who has gone missing. As yet, no information has become available. If anyone has any information regarding Yisra, Ilaste, Borvir, or Rundi, please speak with me at once. Finnish Yes, door. Okay. So... I need to speak to the Thalmor guy, Mirabel, and seeing as apparently apprentices are getting incinerated and going missing, I should also look out for myself. I, I think... The idea of getting you a room at the inn may be a bit premature. Perhaps we should take shifts sleeping and guard each other. And uh, just in case you didn't realise, you're taking the first shift. The fact that this room only has one chair does make breakfast a little, well, uncivilised, doesn't it? Maybe we should find the dining area and indeed perhaps we should read the student handbook college of winterhold student handbook fourth era 171 eighth edition by wunferth the unliving wizard welcome apprentice this text 
is intended to aid in your acclimatization to life at the college. The college is comprised of five towers. The first and foremost is the Hall of Elements, which houses the main lecture hall, the Arcanium, library, the Archmage's quarters, and the midden, which sprawls into the college's foundations. The other four towers, the Halls of Attainment, Countenance, Acumen, and Diligence, are all home to the college's apprentices, scholars, wizards, and staff. The Hall of Diligence is host to the instructor's offices on the top floor, and many members of the college enjoy relaxing in the cantina located on the ground floor of the Hall of Acumen. Okay, Hall of Acumen, ground floor, we've got a cantina. I wonder if they will sell anything, you know, sweet rollish. As an apprentice, you may avail yourself of the full facilities the college has to offer, including training in the five principal schools of magic, enchanting, alchemy, access to crafting facilities, and the opportunity to purchase materials and supplies. Apprentices typically join the college in classes of three to five and are put under mentorship of a specific wizard or scholar. An apprentice who has achieved the rank of erudite has demonstrated an excellence in craft and discipline and are held up as an example to their peers of what can be obtained. A scholar has proven themselves to be an invaluable resource to our institution and often have taken up specific vocations such as history or archaeology which extend the college's knowledge and resources. While their work is not as impressive or glamorous as the wizards proper, they are the bridge between us and the rest of the population, as their expertise and services are valued far and wide. So, as a scholar, I could actually fit in here a little as well. With the rank of wizard and all the mystique and prestige such as such a moniker entails, others will look up to you for guidance, instruction and leadership. It is not a mantle to be borne lightly, and thus is reserved for only the most dedicated and dependable members of our institution, or those people who have someone else steal a staff for them. For example, the uh, advisor to the Jarl in Winterhold. A master wizard accepts administrative duties within the college in addition to their affairs as a wizard. The Archmage is the symbol of the college, representing us in social and political affairs and overseeing critical decisions regarding the present and future of our institution. Sees the face man. Do not take for granted what you may gain here, apprentice. You may desire to learn a few practice spells and set off immediately into the wilds or dangerous unknowns to seek your fortune. Feeling yourself now invincible due to your oaken flesh and unstoppable thanks to the sparks that fly from your fingertips. But take heed, you have much to learn before you are ready to be worthy of respect you undoubtedly feel you deserve. Spend time with the instructors here, invest in their teachings, avail yourself of their offerings, earn the trust and camaraderie of your fellow apprentices. Have their backs just as they will have yours. The bricks that surround you may be as old as Nern's foundations, but everything before you is new. New power, new ways of thinking, and new individuals to call friend or partner. Good luck, apprentice, and may Julianos watch over you. Interesting idea. Earn the trust and camaraderie of your fellow apprentices. Hmm. It would be nice to have an institution like this on your side on occasion, I suppose. However, right now, the plan involves researching the item we found. And for that, we need to speak to Mirabelle. Major's gloves. Um, hello, fellow... Wizardy person? I don't know. I, um, I think we should actually find the cantina. Perhaps that's where we will find Mirabelle. Oh, sorry. Uh. Lead the way. Okay. I didn't. I sorry. I, I was. I was having difficulty whistling. I was having. That's someone upstairs, isn't it? I think so. Groundskeeper Vactis, hello. Can I go? Okay, you're going. Okay. 
So, find Mirabel at the same oh, time really? as finding the dining room, which was the Hall of Acumen. This is the Hall of Attainment. There is a message board. There is a use. I think we're a bit too close. Guards have been saying things about you. That you're the one that, well, they say the Dark Brotherhood. Well, never mind. Has our cover been blown that badly already? Is this because we're wearing these out? There are excavation clothes. They're far more appropriate than the rope. You know what? Let's worry about that. Hall of Acumen is the ability to... Okay, it's over It's over in this direction, I believe. Um, and this is where we will find... Thelsa's Cantina. Thelsa Andalus, Alchemy Instructor. Septimus Cygnus, Scholar, Archaeologist. Okay. Amandra Solas, Scholar. Floor 2, Tarakel Scholar, Lentilus Batiatus, Erudite. Apprentices, Onuja, Melka, Sameth, Nelissa, and Mivrana. Mi 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 I quite fancy talking to the, well, the person who sells food, who also is an alchemy instructor. Why does that worry me slightly? Probably because I know what alchemists can do. I'm also... Curious as to Septimus Sigmus, the archaeologist. However, Mirabel's quarters are not here, so we're not probably going to find her. Let's have a look. Oh. Okay. Hello and need something. Uh, I don't know, would you... you have questions? I do have questions. I one question is why is it so bloody dark in here? Amanra Solas! Yes. I'm having... Oh, you know what? Staff of Ma Mage Light. Okay. I think I think what you do is you you you, you point it somewhere and oh, there there you go. You see, you're welcome. That's better, isn't it? You see? Okay. Uh, is, is the person who runs the cantina around anywhere? Have you? Okay, but... What do you need, handsome? Okay. Thelsa and Dallas's quarters. Hello? Hey. He okay, well, we, I think we found... We found the alchemists room this is what can i do for you probably don't want me wandering around your place septimus Sig hello this is oh uh, we probably shouldn't be no let's not does anybody know where the archaeologist has gone go ah it does I could get used to that. That is a very, very nice form of light, isn't it? Need something? Okay, yeah, I am... Um, you have questions? I do indeed, although I have a feeling I may wish to come back here late at night. You know, when I get the munchies. Um... Check upstairs. I don't think we're going to find... Ooh. This is Tarakel's quarters. Okay. The magic lights are on the fritz. Lentilius but Hello. No. I'm wondering if anybody has seen Oh, that's the that's the Argonian Dems. Nelissa! Hello? Yes, Sora. Oh. 
That light does not last long at all, does it? I, I don't suppose... And what might you need? Well, I'm looking mm. for Mirabelle, but I'm also looking to buy some food from the from the canteen, and the canteen salesperson is not here, so... All right, you know what? We'll go and try somewhere else. Apparently, the, the canteen is not open right now. Yeah, that, that light does not last long at all, which is a shame. For the Hall of Attainment, we've got Tolfdeer, who is the Alteration Instructor, and we have Onmund, Brelina, Marion, Jazago, and Leonard, the Apprentices, and Carno, the Thalmor Advisor. He wants to speak to me, doesn't he? Arniel Gain, Scholar and Historian. Enthir. Enth Enthir's here. Right, yes, of course. Nirya and a guard. Okay, so the guard stays here. Actually, out of curiosity, is Enthir inside? I am wondering. I should definitely keep him up to date with what is... Right, that's... Tolfdir stock probably still at the dig, isn't he? Yes, he is. Okay, you know what? Yeah. This is... Onmund, he's oh he's one of the novices. Okay, sure. Ah, the Thalmo <sighs> Locked door. Yeah, I'm oh. Hello, Brelinia. Before you even ask, yes, I have an ancestry steeped in magic, and no, I don't want to talk you about it. Oh, yes, okay. I know Winterhold uh, used to be full of my bad. kind. And no, I don't care that they're all gone now. Does that cover everything? No. I was wondering if you knew where I could buy food and where Mirabelle was. Oh, and have you seen Enthir? But, um... Yeah, uh... What? I've just been asked enough questions. I'm here to learn not to explain myself over and over. Forgive me. I didn't mean to assume. Yes, but you did, didn't you? Uh, Windhold used to be f full of Dark Elves, did it? I, I actually didn't know that. Didn't you know? That's why I Before asked. Before the Oblivion Crisis, many Elves called Winterhold their home. More visited the college from Morrowind every year. After, growing distrust of magic made life difficult for many. Some left rather than endure the growing hatred from the local Nords. Others returned home after the Red Year, when Vardenfell erupted and caused much destruction. Winterhold itself died in the years between then and now. What's left out there is a husk. Only the college really remains. Okay. Uh, do you like it here, he says, making small talk? So far. If only because no one is telling me how great I ought to be. I just want to learn. I don't want to think about what's expected of me. Okay. Until next time. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Still no closer to finding out where uh, Mirabelle is, or... End there! Hello! Let me give you a bit of advice. Okay. If you want to work on something that's not officially allowed, don't tell anyone you're doing it. You need something you're not officially supposed to have, you come see me. Okay, this is... You tell anyone that I told you, and I'll fry you from the inside out. Got it? Huh? Good. No, you won't, because I'll stab you in the face. Um, we're friends, remember? We don't threaten each other, at least. Taking me up on my own? Okay. I'm assuming you're here for more than a social call. Down to business, eh? What were you giving me for this? Okay, we, 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 we can look at the minute. Um, what's not allowed here? Purposely killing your fellow college members is a bad idea. I'd advise against it. Noted. An assault can get you into trouble as well. As for research, well, a sufficient explanation will cover almost anything. If you're going to need live test subjects for your experiments, it's easier to do that off of college grounds. Okay, so don't In ask. In regards to Carlia, if you see her. Don't. Oh, oh, we this we can take this. We can. Okay, we might not need to find... You know what? I want some apple pie. Ah, uh, 
we're, we're, we're good, we're good, we're good. He says, Niria? Hello. No, you know what? Okay. Still no word from your family? No. Are you an alchemist? Uh, right, no, we can talk to everybody later, so nice. right? We, we don't need food. Skyrim just to get away from my family's expectations. My family didn't. I'm always on we, the we can, we, we, can, we can get to know everyone uh, a little later on and see what um, inroads we can make to getting everybody on our side. But we are supposed to be speaking to um, Mirabel. So we've got the food side of things sorted. Now we need... Okay, that's not... Is somebody... Oh. People are probably practicing spells, aren't they? They're probably practicing sp... Uh, is... One of you Mirabel? No, mi mi mir mi Okay, not even going to try and pronounce. Um, groundskeeper. Mr. Dragonfly is having a good time at the moment. He enjoys traveling with us very much. Okay, that, that's nice, that's nice. Does Mr. Dragonfly have any idea where we can find Mirabel? Right, Hall of Countenance. We've got Feraldra, Destruction Instructor, Finnish Guest Store, who we should be speaking to anyway. Urag Grow Shrub, Scholar and Librarian. Drevis Nelorian, Illusionism Instructor. Lord 2, Colette Merentz, Restoration, Sergius Turianus, Scholar and Enchanting Services, Orthorn, Erudite, Enchanting and Alchemy Workshops. Okay, so no, no Mirabel though. I don't mind the snow. It's yes, so on. Aren't you the alchemist who's... Need something. Okay, so you... Don't stare at the eyes. So you're a master alchemist and also a bartender. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. Ah, uh, no, no, it's 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 a new. Not judging. Good. Perhaps I've misjudged. Okay, what do you have for sale? So you wish to master the arcane arts? Actually, I wish to buy a sweet roll, but oh, you've got some. I'll I'll take them both and. Take a look at what else you have as well. Why not? While I'm here. Oh, you could probably buy some stuff from me, I guess. Mirabel Irvine, Master Wizard. Okay, so she's in the Hall of Diligence. Apprentices, Rundi, Borvir, Ilaste, Yistra, Suj. Are those the missing apprentices? Uh, Vactis, Groundskeeper. And instructor offices. Okay, so we found Mirabel, assuming she is actually in her room, which is, of course, really, really is very, very dark. Um, okay. Really is monumentally useful. Why didn't we get one of these earlier? Okay, so we. Oh. Hello? Okay. Ebony dagger of <clears throat> We should probably be careful for the near future. I mean you know Wow well, that does not last long. Wizards sort of, you know, they they, they have ways of finding things out, right? We, we should just... We should... Once our business here is concluded, we can do a quick uh, 
once over, maybe. Uh, just, 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 just too much temptation. Yes, indeed. Uh, let's run. D Was the elf in Falkreath called Rundil or Rundi? It was Rundil, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Okay. Well, Mirabel does not seem to be here. Uh, hello. It really is marginally irritating how quick it runs out. Um. Finis there are few places where one can pursue my type of work without fear of persecution. Finish. Yeah. Oh, I actually need to speak. Well, if I don't need to. If you require assistance with summoning techniques, please let me know. No, but I am curious. If you would, please also contain your summons to the college grounds. The locals do not need to be agitated further by Atronox roaming their town. The summoning no worries. of undead is even less advisable outside the college. Oh. You have nothing to worry about on that. Summoning undead isn't frowned upon. Is it not frowned upon everywhere, really? I mean, it's really not hygienic. I mean, just please tell me you don't summon undead around, like, the canteen area and things. Isn't it frowned upon? I sure no. Those archaic policies died out with the Mages Guild and were never enforced here. Okay. Necromancy, as any other type of magic, is a tool to be used. Oh, it's... Of course, non-mages may not see it that way, so we don't go around flaunting it. Yeah, so provincial of these non-mages. Uh, are there many conjurers outside the college? Not within society, no. Many who practice within the School of Conjuration do so on their own, secretly. Thalion is the only one I know who is public about what he does. He was once my teacher here, but left the college years ago. Thalion, that name rings a bell. Can you teach me about Conjure? You, Yeah, you posted a notice about missing apprentices. Why are apprentices going missing? Do I need to be careful? Ah, that, yes. The group prior to yours has disappeared entirely. It's possible that there was less than the necessary amount of oversight. That's still being looked into. The entire group! But we've had no contact with them for quite some time now. Arniel wondered if perhaps they'd somehow managed to get themselves lost in the Outer Realms. But I think that's giving them too much credit. Where could they have gone? Right, uh... I'm not sure. None of them were working on anything terribly dangerous. As I recall, Yisra was trying to improve flame cloak spells to better work in Skyrim's harsh environment. Elos Tai was practicing illusion spells. She was having trouble with the calm spells, I believe, but only ever worked with skeevers. And then there's Borvir and Rundi, twins, though they rarely agreed on anything. Those two boys were obsessed with mead, convinced they could concoct something to compete with hunting brew. Something about using frost magic to chill the mead for a certain period of time. I felt it was a waste, but the Archmage let them proceed. Okay. Um. I'm just, yeah, okay, thank you very much. All right, then. That is a little worrying, isn't it? I mean, if... Enchanting Services Ledger. Oh, right, enchanting goes on here. Um, if the last group of mages went missing, is it possible that the current group could go missing? Uh, Colette Marantz, um, your name rings a bell? You consider restoration a valid school of magic worthy of study, don't you? Um... Don't you? Yes! Yes, of course! Good. Good. Not that I require validation, of course. There are just some, and I shan't name names, 
Who would disagree? Okay. It can make life difficult when one's colleagues fail to recognize the research one engages in. Absolutely. So you're tr you're treated badly because of your work. Yeah, but you you your your magic heals and things. That does actually sound quite useful. Well, no, not really, not directly. I mean, but I know things are being said behind my back. Conversations cease when I enter rooms. I'm quite aware of what's going on here, and I will not stand for it. Have you thought perhaps it's because you're a little snippy? All right then. Just, just, just going, 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 going. Barry, where are the stairs? I've lost the stairs. I've lost the stairs. I need a spell to give me directions. Actually, I, I actually have. Clairvoyance, although apparently it's failing me. No, it's not. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, oh. Could I use that to find Mirabelle? I probably could use that to find Mirabelle. I just never thought of it. I'm sort of like... Okay, I'm not going to get used to that. No, I'm not. All right. Uh... What is it? Okay, you people don't get irritated when I do things like this, do they? Okay, I'm going in that direction. Where does snow come from, I wonder? Oh, my okay, is that Mirabel? Mirabel! Mirabel! Just don't antagonize him. Urag can be helpful. Okay, the Archmage asked me to see you about. Class. No, he didn't. He asked me to see about research. What's expected of me? Aren't I supposed to be doing research? There are no expectations. This college is a place to study and practice magic freely. Hopefully any discoveries made in your pursuits will be shared with the members of the college first. That way we all benefit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sharing. That's, that's, I'm all about sharing. What do you know about the Sigic Order? No more than anyone else, I don't think. They're a very old order, predated the Imperial Mages Guild by quite a bit. In fact, the Mages Guild was founded in opposition to the idea of the Sigic Order, that only an elite few should have control over magic. No one has seen or heard from them in over a hundred years now, though. So they were control freaks. Elitists. Sound okay to me. Um, the Archmage asked me to see you about class. He actually asked me to see you about research, didn't he? I think? Yes, from what I've heard, I expect Tolkdale will be occupied for some time. Hmm, that is a problem, isn't it? I suppose someone else will need to look after the apprentices for now. Don't! No! I am- uh, no, I've just- I am an apprentice, you can't- Please don't ask me to look after the apprentices. Apprentices? What should I do if there's no class? Well, perhaps it's time for some independent study. Yes! Check with Urag independent. Roshak in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of any references to this thing that you and Tolkdia found. That's... I'd like to know as much as we can about it. Me too. That's what he... Right, speak to Urag Groshup. That's what the Archmage said, I think. And that's the... Right, that's... He's... That's the guy in the Arcanium, isn't it? The guy that was complaining about wet books. Yeah, sounds like a typical lie. That guy wants to see us. Yeah, sounds like a typical librarian. Okay. Oh, good grief. And you are Drevis Nelorin. That name rings a bell. Finis Yestor Ser Sergius Tyrannius Enchanting services Urag few things that keep You're not an Urag You look like an Urag Groshub Yes You are now in the Arcanium Of which I am in charge It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion Disrupt my Arcanium And I will have you torn apart by angry Atronachs Now do you require assistance? 
plane of oblivion. So you're like a, like a Daedric prince. And your spheres are lending books and shushing people. <laughs>